defeat me! <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back for another episode of Diablo 3. In our solo live streams, we've pushed all the way up to Torment 12, and we seem to be pretty comfortable at this level. Um, it looks like Matrix is punching about the same weight, because he's just completed a tier 56. Um, so we're going to uh, team up with him, and we're going to see how much further we can push in today. For me, mostly I'm going to be working on my legendary gems, but we do have some things to look at here. We've got a Torment 12 Rift in 6 minutes. We might be able to manage that with just the two of us. Uh, we've got a season conquest to do. We might do that today. Uh, most likely that would be worlds apart, killing all the various bosses um, within 20 minutes of the start of the game. Uh, we've got Urzil to kill at Torment 13 and Rakanoth at Torment 13. We could hop up to do those. Might be a little bit dangerous, but they are they are certainly possible. Urzil's probably the most dangerous of the two. Rakanoth does have a quick dashing move, but Urzil can do that flamethrower which just minces everything either way uh, we're going to wait until matrix is ready and then we're going to join him in game so give me just a moment i'll be right back i'm wearing the shadow set um i can't tell the difference because the amount of crap that you shoot out anyway i can hear a whip 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 sound that wasn't there before that's new yeah that, that that's uh uh me using the uh the impale skill um it's a much faster build um, than the uh, uh, than the multi-shot one. I do have both available. Um, so I wanted to have a quick chat about the season journey and where you are with stuff. Um, I've got four bits left to do. Um, the six minutes to save the world, a conquest, and the two bosses at Torment 13. What have you got left for the destroyer level? Uh, just the last three of those. So a conquest and the two bosses at Torment 13. Okay. Well... For the conquests, what have we got this season? Let's uh, have a look. It's why, yeah, there we go, season conquests. So there is... I've, I've actually got a whole tab open with the different conquests listed over in my other monitor. Speed Racer, acts 1 through 5 in under an hour in hardcore mode. It doesn't actually give a specific difficulty level for that, does it? That, that can be on normal. In fact, it's recommended that it be on normal because otherwise you can't do it. Okay. I'm very, very, very fast. Um, I could potentially be. I've been working on a speed racer build, which is about two thirds complete. Um, shall I give you an example? Um, yeah. Uh, let Let's go back to the menu. Okay. I need to switch to my the difficulty down to normal. Yeah, I need to switch to my barbarian as well because I'm going to need Crown's buff belt as well. Uh, so let me just switch to Sir Spike a lot. And game settings. I should point out as well that um, it would take us virtually an entire hour to do this. So I don't think we should do that tonight. I think we should prepare an actual plan for this off okay. camera and then approach it. But we can still talk through a little bit about what we're going to do for it now. All right. So I'm going to very quickly take off this belt and just... Keep it in the inventory for the moment. Oh, Dark and Shadow, you're still using Windows XP. I thought that was past its end of life support now. I'm pretty certain it is. Right, I'm going to switch back to uh, Exploder Face. Thank you very much, Adam. It's really appreciated for that. And you are Adam, subscriber 205. And um, yeah, Wolfried, you're probably right. We're probably not quite fast enough for this conquest. Um, Losing the Chain of Shadows belt would make a big difference, but what I can do is I can cube it so that I don't need Visage of Goons. So this can go in the cube. That's the main reason why I moved it across. Um, but Matrix, you were about to talk about the uh, the plan. Yeah, so um, do you want to come up to the Southern Highlands waypoint? Okay. Because I think this is a good benchmark. From what I've heard, like if if we like both stand here, okay, all right, kill these guys, right? Um, let's let's try and race to Leoric Manor, okay? All right. Uh, all three, right. three, two, two one. one, go. No, not this way. 
and I'm still trying to figure out my way around. I've gone the wrong way. Like, <laughs> I could do this. I could do this much faster. Like, once I actually figure out where I'm going. I'm thinking the same thing. Oh yeah, it's up, isn't it? It is. Like, in theory, if you're going to do Speed Racer, it should only take about 20 seconds. Oh, right. E okay, even from I've all the way it. down there. Wow. I've made it. And that was very, very slow. Yeah. Really, really slow. Really, really slow. <laughs> How far away are you? Uh, I'm... I'm not managing my um, discipline properly. I'm just... Here we go. Yeah, that right. was... Right. Let's try that again, okay? So go back to the Southern Highlands. Now you know where you're actually going. We can sort of look at the time and try and time it. Okay. Right. Uh... So... Uh, right, it's going to be 30 seconds. Two, one. Go. Oh my god, I am so slow compared to you. Yeah, and you're supposed to be faster in theory. I've just made it. So I can make it in 30 seconds. And I think you're supposed to be able to make it in just under 20. Wow. And I mean, I'm, part, I'm... Of this, part, part of this is that my reaction speed is not great. I think it's partly because we're streaming at the moment. And that kind of whacks latency up by about 80 milliseconds or so. Um, so I think that's going to count against us quite a lot. Um, but also, you're way too slow. Yes, I, I really am. I don't have my perfect gear for this. So I can't sprint indefinitely. By well, sprint, I mean dash. We've, we've done all bosses in under 20 minutes. We've done the Worlds Apart one. So we could do that as our first conquest. Yes. Yeah, yeah. I think that's far more reasonable because I can just wear normal gear for that, pretty much. Yeah. But yeah, so I, I just wanted to show you how slow you are and how fast we really need to be. Okay. If we're going to do all bosses, I could still keep the um, Impale set on. That won't be a problem. Uh, but we need, do need to go back to the menu. So, do you have my list of bosses that I'm going to be going for? I do. I believe I've sent it over to you on uh, Hangouts. All right. Uh, give me a moment. And... So now I actually have my uh, my list. Uh, we can start a new game at Torment 10. Let me change the difficulty settings. Just as, Oh, Which actually, you, you need to do it, yeah, because you're the leader. Okay. Whoa, big deep breath. Uh, are you ready? We're going to oh. try and do this uh, boss mode. I am. So I'm starting with Urziel and I will move on from there. And I'm starting with Adria, which I hate, but there we go. Yeah, I probably should have gone for something with more mobility, like actually a dashing strike build, but we'll see how this goes. Right. So Act 5, Urziel. It's not a bounty one, so I'm going to be hunting, but uh, we can hope. And I'm trying to use Epiphany to teleport around faster here, where I can. No, not that way. Ah, my god, I hate the way that this place is laid out. Yeah, try the ruins of Corvus. <laughs> Thank you very much, Adam. Yes, I am the uh, the PC necromancer. I mean, if it goes wrong, I will try and resurrect it from the grave. And don't forget, when you get there, if you get there first, go back to town. Yeah, uh, leave a portal and head back to town. And then we both go in and fight the uh, the boss, don't we? Yes.
Although, the way this place is laid out, I don't see how I'm going to be the first one there. Oh, you might be. <laughs> don't forget, Ruins of Corvus. Yeah, this is true. Oh, for crying out loud. Okay, right. I, I've got to mine, so I'm going back to town. Right, so I know, I know door, where it is now. There's like one tiny bit. Oh, nice. I'm very Good nearly there. there while I freeze. Okay, uh, I'm here. Freeze Shall I go did, in? Um, his, yeah, go in. Yep. While I freeze did his solo uh, in under 15 minutes. So no pressure, right? Wow. He's already done his thing. Yep. And then... Right, he's gone. Right, map back to town for me. It's very important yes. to go map back to town so that you can then dip through the portal and start the next fight. Except... Okay, map on to Diablo for me. And on to Iswal for me. Well, there's Iswal, there's Diablo. And uh, yeah, it would be uh, it would be cool, but unfortunately, um, cross um, platform gameplay I don't think has yet been enabled. Um, also, we only uh, play with each other. But thank you very much for the thought of it. <laughs> Um, that sounds a bit ruder than he meant. Uh, we actually do play games um, with all sorts of other people. Um, uh, when he said we play with each other, he didn't mean in a sexual way. <laughs> all I wanted to clear out. <laughs> no, but uh, when we're playing Diablo, we only uh, really play with uh, with us and Kev, I suppose. But um... <laughs> yes, the team mascot. And Pinnacle I mean of Heaven. Really right. nice way. I'm here. Back to town for me. Okay. I've just arrived at mine, so let me know as soon as you're ready. I am in town. Right. Oh my god, just die. Right. Map, back to town for me. There's this planned staff of herding there. I really want it, but I can't get it. Because I was already doing the town portal. I would pick it up if I could, but I can't. So, next for me is going to be Aaron I. God, that's going to be annoying. That was nice and quick. Yep. Next for me is going to be the butcher. Okay. Don't map. forget we have to wait for him to actually die. Yes. I'm getting ready to go to the butcher. One, one butcher. Aaron, I. I'm not even picking up death's breaths. Neither am I. It makes me sad. I'm not even stopping for the gem goblins. You're doing very well. I'm there. Heading back to okay, town. It's gonna, yeah, it's going to take me a while to find her place. Woo! Well, in that case, I will take the opportunity to drink a little bit of my um, liquid refreshment.
Here, Aranai. Where are you? No, that's another bag. Is that the way? No, it's not. It's not this way. It means it must be the other way. It's okay. It's not like you're letting the team down. I know. <laughs> you're letting the team down if I gave you the spider caverns. Oh, it's not on any of these. I need uh, to lower down this one. I, I know how annoying the spider caverns are. Trust me. So, I, you've got the slight advantage of being able to dash through some places, but uh, yeah, it is not a fun one. And yes, uh, Wolfried, the suspense is real. Uh, we are attempting the Worlds Apart conquest for those joining in live chat at the moment. Uh, so far, we've got a couple of bosses down, but um, we are running Here low we go. on time. Right. Okay. Oh, no, you don't. Got her. <laughs> right. Map, back to town for me. Yep. Into the Chamber of Suffering. Okay, I am moving on to Maltiel. And for me, it is the Siege Breaker. Oh, there's a ring right there. I'm going to get to Maltiel before you get to the Siege Breaker, I'm sure. So I'm grabbing that ring. Yeah, pretty sure. Given my way is marked right from the start. I'm on the underbridge bit. Oh, I found where close. the shadow set dungeon is by mistake. Um, I am here, so I'm <laughs> heading back to town. Don't take a detour into the shadow set dungeon. That's <laughs> quite out of your way. I, yeah, I mean, that was that was a bit surprising. I was just like, oh, there it is. What's it doing here? Okay, I'm in town as soon as you're ready. I'm liquid liquid refreshment there. is whiskey today. <laughs> here we go. Right, map back to town for me. Oh my god, something else has dropped. Where is town? Town's there. It's a dagger. Oh, it looks like the Envious Blade. No, it can't be the Envious Blade. That's a specific one. All right, Pandemonium Fortress. Heart of the Fortress. Let's kill this bugger. So, Gom is for me next. And next for me will be Sadia. Yeah, he's done his first bit. At least I thought he had. I mean, he stopped taking damage. Yeah, he goes through two stages in that first stage. Okay, on to Sadir. Uh, act three, Sadir. There we go. Uh, we got to wait for him to finish dying, don't we? Greenstone's fan. That's the one that it was. Yeah. You're entirely right. Okay. There we go. It can go now. And don't worry, I won't get drunk. I'm just having a little bit to take the edge off. That's what they say, right? That's what all good alcoholics say. <laughs> good alcoholics don't need to take the edge off because there is no edge. Good alcoholics just have rounded corners for when they fall over? Yeah, pretty much. I found one of the ways that it's not. Ah, uh, damn annoying corners. I mean, I'm still going to beat you there by loads, but... Uh... 
I'm here. No, oh, I'm not. What? Am oh, what? Right. Are you? Yes, I am here. Okay. I'm going back to town. Let me know when you're in town. Ready? Alright, that's the heart of the cursed. Yeah, if you could just hurry us up down there, thanks. That's what I'm trying. I keep getting snagged like a baggy jumper. Alright, you're back to town. So my next is going to be the Skeletal King. Uh, yes, uh, Dark Shadow, this is a conquest to kill all the bosses in the game within 20 minutes of the start of the game. Right, I am off to kill the Skeleton King. And for me, it's Asmodan. Yeah, good, I did go to the right place. Always a worry. Oh my god, I'm trapped behind a wall thing, right? There we go. Yeah, I keep getting trapped behind walls of people. Well, by people, I mean demons, but... And walls, apparently. Okay, I'm here, heading back to town. Okay, I'm almost at mine. I am... In town now. Okay, here we go. Heart of Sin coming up in two, one. Okay, map back to town for me. Where is town? There's town. Next for you is Rakanoth. Yep, that's going to be fine. Right, I am off to Rakanoth then. Act four. Belial for me. I think we're doing okay on the time. I'm here, going back to town. Okay. I am at mine as well kind now. Of. Are you back in town? Almost, not quite. Yes. Okay, back to town for you. Yep. And then through the portal. Into the Imperial Palace. And yes, it would be a bit nuts to be able to vault around like this and go everywhere. Yeah, I've got no, like, mob-killing power. I am just an assassin. <laughs> so next for me is Magda. There we go. Right, I'm off to kill Magda. Uh, which is actually in the same act. Ah. Uh. Now we can go. I'm at cool already. <laughs> well, yeah, that's not a surprise. I'm 
I'm in town. Someone tried to put a wall in my way. Didn't work. Okay, I'm here. Going go, in. Go, go. Okay, back to town for you. She didn't even get to spawn the ants that explode. Well, they all just exploded inside of her. That sounds kinky. There we go, worlds yeah. apart. Awesome. Like it says, easy. Now, did you want to go back to Iswell to get that plan? Yes! Yes, I do! <laughs> right. Because the Staff of Herding is worth grabbing when, uh, when the opportunity presents itself. Yeah, why not? I mock everyone who thought that this was not going to work. That includes me, by the way. Who thought it wasn't going to work? Uh, well, Wallafried said Rip Conquest Dream when I was taking forever over the uh, spider <laughs> caverns. Well, yes. Uh, I think we only took 18 minutes in total. Luckily, you've already mapped out the area, so I know where I'm going to get to the Great Span. Yeah, yeah you're welcome. Where's my plans? Where's my plans are gone? They're not here! No! no! <laughs> Oh. Do, you, do you want to know what's even funnier as well, a little bit? Do you got some? Uh, you could have gone to the next area and then gone backwards. And it would have saved you a lot of time. That makes me sad. Look, sh shall I do that? I'll go to Act 4 and I'll go to the Silver Spire Level 2. And then I'll go back. Hello. This is me at the Great Span. Yeah, I'm... Um, I don't think it would have made a difference because it had been more than five minutes since we fought as well. And I, I think there is like a time limit on it, but damn it. Oh, all of my loot is still here. Ooh, I did, however, get an ancient convention of elements. Well, that, it's not all bad then, is it? And I do want a, a convention of elements for this character anyway, so I'm going to switch over to that. Cool. Anyway, uh, that conquest is going to be enough to fill out this episode, I think. Uh, yeah, so I thank agree. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. I hope you've enjoyed this as much as we have. We've managed to bumble through the conquest without too many hiccups along the way. And all in all, that was rather successful. So, yay us. Uh, anyway, remember to like these videos if you like them and subscribe to our channels if you have not already. And we'll see you again soon for some more Diablo 3. We'll see you soon.